Glad you can make it this time, man. How are the mashed potatoes? They're good. So what'd you end up doing today? Work. Really? So what did you actually do? What? I was driving earlier today. Nowhere to go. No plans, really. Just wandering. So I thought to myself, hmm, maybe I'll visit Dave at work. We both know how that story ends. You went to Forever 21? That's right. Lots of ripped jeans, lots of teenage girls, but no Dave. You don't know what you're talking about. I know that your alibi doesn't hold up. And that tells me that you're hiding something. So tell me, Dave, where were you? I don't have to tell you shit. <laughs> I don't like these games, Dave. Where were you? You don't want to know where I was. You don't want to know that I was at the hospital because my fiance was having heart surgery. Dave. I'm... No, you don't want to know that when they were moving her from the ICU, they accidentally dropped her on her head. Dave, listen. No, you ask. So, so you're going to know that the dying words of my soon to be wife were Is that what you wanted to hear? Dave. You don't have a fiance. Why don't you tell that to my dead fiance? Why don't you tell her yourself? your hands on the table, palms face down. What? Why? Just do it. Brad, what are you doing? Brad, this isn't funny. Stop. Dave? Dave. It's me. Stacy. What is this? You know that I don't blame you, right? Brad. Brad, please stop. I love you, Dave. Brad, stop. I love that you're never afraid to cry. Stop! Come join me. Stop! Please! Stop! Come with me! Whoa. What? Oh, I just had the craziest dream. You fell asleep? I guess so. <laughs> What'd you put in these mashed potatoes? Dextrimethorphan. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was a stupid joke.